Happy Wednesday, everybody. It's SIQ. Hello, everybody. Today is the... I got to look and see what day it is. It's the 19th, you guys. I hope you seen that. Just come in and do a quick walk and chat. My honey getting out the car to walk with me today. In a minute. I told her, let me do this real quick. Let me come in and tell you guys what's been going on with me. So... For the last four days, you guys, I've been down. I would say my body was going through, was going through a flare up. The reason why I stop and pause, because I see a man that looked like he about 10 feet tall, walking through the forest, and it's kind of like spooky to me over that way. And I don't even see him walking no more, so I'm not finna walk that way. I'm finna walk back. I see him walking now. But look at the water, you guys. The water is rising here. Look. See how well it's flowing? It's getting higher. See it? The river flowing, you guys, is getting real high. They said it's I'm scared it'll overflow overflow because we finna get a lot of more rain. It's been it started raining early this morning. And it's supposed to rain again today. This is my first day out in days, you guys. First time seeing my honey in days. First time being out walking in days. It's been about four days, I think. About four days. I've been under the weather, you guys. Not mentally, to be honest with you, physically under the weather. Mentally, I've been good, okay? I'll just tell you that. I've been good mentally. It's just physically, it's been hitting me, honey. At first, it's like I was trying to like get a cold, but I've been taking my uh, emergency C 24 hours. That's been helping me. All my vitamins, well, I haven't been taking them, but for the last two days I have. The first few days I wasn't feeling well, I wasn't taking them, I ain't gonna lie. I was just in the bed, you guys, like just going through it. But I'm starting to feel better. Tomorrow was supposed to have been the day that I go, I was invited to go bowling. My uh, honey co-worker having a, uh, his birthday, and he wanted me to, he invited me to come with them, but I'm gonna have to cancel that. My honey kind of upset about it, but she understands that I'm just starting to feel better. I'm not finna rush and do anything. You know what I mean? Like, I know it's been planned, but I wasn't planning not to feel well. And now that I'm starting to feel better, I want to take my time and doing things. You know, I don't want to go, go bowling and be around a lot of people and all that stuff. And, you know, I just ain't up for that right now. So I told her while they bowling and all that stuff tomorrow, I'm going to make my spinach pie. That way I can, you know, have the food that I eat for a few days. You know, I'm starting to move back around. I had supposed to make my spinach pie, you guys, like a week ago. But, yeah. My honey out the car already. I'm surprised. Barely get out the car, but out the car today. But I'm going to walk down here. Should be alright without me. So we went to the Dollar Tree, you guys. Let me tell you about the Dollar Tree. This Dollar Tree didn't have number one roll of paper towel, which was an essential roll. I normally don't buy those rolls. It was a bounty, I think it was. Only had like 40 sheets. That ain't going to do me no time, but probably a day or two. So I didn't get it. So I have to go pick my uh, medication up guys they called me days ago to come pick up my medic my lupus medication i didn't go get it i have to go get it today because after seven days they'll send it back it's been about four i hope they still have it so yeah but back to the dollar tree you guys dollar tree has some nice stuff normally i'll be able to go on the dollar tree you know what i mean and pick stuff up that I like and put it around and make it look nice, you guys. My feelings literally got hurt in the Dollar Tree because I couldn't go in there and pick up everything that I wanted. I had to only go in there and pick up everything I needed. This transitioning, you guys, I didn't think 
I've been through it before, but I didn't think it had me in my feelings like it did today. Like I literally went in there and got and purchased five things. One box of Kleenex, four packs of disinfect wipes. The ones that I always get. If you guys watch my videos, you know what I'm talking about. They normally come 30 in a pack. Now they come 40 in a pack, which is really great for me. I was only going to get three, but I said, let me get four. Anyway, that'll last me for a while. So hopefully those wipes that I have will last me for the rest of the month. Hopefully. I know the Kleenex won't because my nose run like crazy, but the disinfects wipes will. So, yeah, they had a lot of new stuff out. The glasses is blue and the plates and the bowls. You know, little stuff like that. Like a lot of stuff. I just, y'all, I was in my feelings so bad. Let me tell you. I didn't even walk around the whole Dollar Tree no more. I mean, today. I kept looking down the aisles. I didn't even walk down the aisles to even see all the new stuff they had. And they had plenty of stuff in there, you guys. You could see it from a distance. So, yeah, I was in my feelings today. I can get through this transition, you guys, because I come from a place to where I know how to make it on whatever I have or whatever I'm blessed with. But sometimes, this last past couple years, last past year, I really had to cut my expenses because everything is going up, you know. My family moved out, which means less income coming in the house to keep it, to, to be honest. So it was kind of a heartbreak <laughs> today. I saw you over there. I was like, all the snow melted over there. Okay, go ahead. But yeah. I don't know, I'm thinking I might have to go to the house first. Okay. You hear me? Yeah. I gotta go to the ladies' rooms. We gotta go pick my medicine up, but I need to go to the house, you guys. I don't like, like, these bathrooms. There's outdoor bathrooms. I'm not using no outdoor bathrooms. I really don't like using a bathroom in public to tell you guys the truth. So, and we have to pass the house to go get the medicine anyway. I gotta go to the house, I gotta use it. <laughs> so we finna head to the house, then head to Cubs, pick my medicine up, and I ain't gonna even lie, y'all, I'm getting me something sweet. I'm getting me a pack of cookies. I ain't gonna even lie. I'm getting me a pack of Oreos or chocolate chip cookies. Something that I know that I don't need, I'm getting that today. Yeah. See? See how the water is, you guys? See how it's flowing? It's getting higher and higher. See? Remember this, y'all? It had a lot of snow. Remember? I do my videos right here. You guys want to do a stretch? I ain't done a stretch on camera in a minute. Let's do a stretch. I've done my plank today. Let's stretch it out, ladies. You know, in the rain, it make you have arthritis real bad. You know that? <laughs> but a good stretch will help you guys. Get you a good stretch. Know what I mean? When you have pain, sometimes a stretch helps a lot. But yeah, my back starting to hurt. When I woke up, everything was hurting on me today, you guys. Everything. Because of the rain and the arthritis, it hurts a lot. A quick park workout. That's it. That's it. 
try to do things normal again. If you guys watch my videos, I come here and walk and do that little quick stretch. That felt kind of good. I ain't done a stretch like that outside since, what, last summer? <laughs> See, all the snow is gone now, you guys. I'm happy about it. I really am. But, yeah, I can't. I can. How can you get in your feelings about not being able to shop at the Dollar Tree? <laughs> that lets you know I am a Dollar Tree head, a Dollar Tree queen, a Dollar Tree addict. I really was in my feelings and I was telling my boo, I'm like, I'm in my feelings. And she's like, well, I'm like, because I can't shop how I want to. The one she said, well, you know, sometimes it be like that. She treated me out to eat. She treated me to Culver's today. But next time is my treat. And my tree sometimes, I, sometimes I'll be like, I really don't be want her to treat because when it be my time to treat, I don't have money all the time no more. That's why I be off in the cook for and stuff like that. I'd rather cook something that she likes. She don't eat much. Like if I cook sausages and rice, she'll be good. I'm telling you. Yeah, if I just cook rice and eggs, sometimes she'd be good, so... But yeah, she didn't come over my house and stay the night this week because I wasn't feeling well. And when I'm not feeling well, I, I can't attend to her like I want to when I'm not feeling well. She says she don't mind, but I can't attend to her. I, I can't. And I like to attend to my boo. Whether that's cooking, going to the park, going walking, you know, whatever it is, I couldn't do it. So I, you know, isolated myself for about a four or five, the last four or five days. But I'm feeling better, you guys. Like I said, I'm just letting you know it was not a mental thing. Like if I'm going through a mental thing of depression, I'll let you guys know. I don't have no problem. I have depression. I have depression for years. I will let you know. I have no shame about it. But this here is just a physical thing. I knew once my eyes was swelling up, you guys, I said, I'm finally going to a flare. I'm finally going to one of them lupus flare-ups. That's what I call it. It puts me on my butt this time, you guys, real bad. But anyway, I'm about to get out of here. I'm about to go to the house, use the ladies' room, and go get my medicine. And I probably won't get my medicine until she get ready to go to work. I, on her way to work, she could just run me to get it and drop me off. No, I think I'm okay to run and get the medicine first. I don't want to come back out. All right, you guys, I'll upload this later. I'm going to spend time with my boo. Talk to you guys later. Bye.